We're up. All right, all right. Welcome back to the increase of the illustrious idiots. For those of you watching the Twitch stream, of course, we love you guys. Um, we're still going, <laughs> uh, and we are continuing the fight. Uh, Leas just failed with Bigby's hand. Next is Rand, who is going to be shooting his death bow at the number <laughs> one of those little blue idiots there. Cool. Roll them bars and bar damages. Uh, Sixteen. Okay. And then the other one? Because you get two shots, right? A natural one that I have no. Halfling, uh, halfling luck. So I get a reroll at once. So that's another sixteen. I don't. What are you looking up the halfway lot? Yeah, I just want to. I just want to check something. I remember we did last time, and we I were like, "That's really OP." Rest. Yeah, it might be. Oh yeah, I think that's true. Halfway. If not, I just, then I just rolled a. Lucky. When you roll a one on the d20 for an attack roll, ability check, or saving throw, it's you can me. you can re-roll the die and must use the new roll. So in theory, you could critically fail, but it's a lot more difficult. It's, for you, to you have to roll two ones in a row. Yeah, and that's all it says, right? It's fucking dope. It doesn't say anything about limitations. No. Nope. Yep. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Now it's, it's my lucky. Impossible. It's my lucky feet that has the long rest. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's almost impossible for you to roll ones. Yeah. yeah so bad. I rolled two sixteens. Okay. Um, let's see here. We are so, going... Theoretically, you can re-roll two ones in a row. <laughs> so, what was your other attack roll? And lucky the same? Uh, both were exactly the same. Got after, it. Yeah. So, uh, give me both attack rolls. Actually, no, don't worry about it. Which yeah, one do you want to kill? Uh, blue mofo, that one, yeah. Alright. So, so they're all blue. That, that one's... That one's Whatever. Nice. Purple Soren. Is, purple is a shade of blue. Soren. You're a shade of Stupid. You feel... <laughs> Um, I'm glad that's where he went with it too. Really apparently, I was, I was actually more hoping you're a shade of fuck you, but that would have been better, but you know. You can feel what? the power from this piece of the Pearl of Heaven. You feel the touch. You feel from it. Um, <laughs> yeah. I'm all kind of musical tonight, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Enjoy it. Um, it you're not sure exactly how to process it, but you can sense the hostility. Can I move? Yes, you are free to move. Okay, if I move backward, that's not disengaging. Mm. <laughs> yes, it is. He has crazy. You don't, you don't crazy get cutting range. action until second rogue level. I'm not a rogue. He's a shadow hunter. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Hmm. Hmm. I'm guessing that you've moved Hunter's Mark over to the big guy. Yeah. Reasonably that's fine. Just in case. Yeah, that's reasonable. Um, shit. Well, wait. Where's the uh, pearl at? Chest. Kind of where the center the red, red dot is. The red dot is, yeah. How far in there is it? Um, give me a... Give me a perception check. Because you have the piece, I'll give you advantage. <laughs> 16. 16, okay. Um, you know that it is in... It's, uh, it, it's within, like you can't see the piece. How thick is he, I guess, is the question? Uh, uh, he's good. He's pretty thick. We'll say that's a moment. That's thick as my dick. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. From within, within, within. Alright, so I'm guessing it's my turn though. It is your turn. turn, yes. We're over here fighting these little motherfuckers and he's <laughs> the one person in front of this giant yep. creepazoid. What you got? I'm gonna look calmly up at him and say, "You have my friend." And, and then I'm gonna shoot it in the face. Then we shoot it in the face. Okay. 
Yeah, it's more like it. Uh, yeah, let's use uh, Mark's mode, the first one. Okay. 12 minus... Uh, 20, it's 20. 12 yes. plus 13 minus 20. 20 will hit, yes. That is going to be... Regular shot. He has no damage done him, does he? Nope. This is the first damages. We've had a we've had a Mongol horde to deal with over here. Seven, eight, nine, nine and ten is nineteen plus ten more is twenty nine. I see. Twenty nine. That's pretty delicious damage. Did it do anything? Not noticeably. Um it you're, your arrow goes into it, it's like all the way in. Um, it did damage, right? It, 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 it did, did something. Damage. It did okay, damage. that's what. I'm not, I'm not just you. Yeah. yeah, my head against the wall. Yeah, yeah. it did damage. All it right. did damage. Uh, I'm going to hit March one again. Okay. Nope. Thirteen's not a hit. So. Thirteen. Okay. So that's true. Fair enough. Next is... Uh, how does the hammer sphere work? The card. Do you have the card? No, I mean to actually use it. Oh, uh... It to, to, yeah, it's a bonus action to, like, spawn it. Can I do that? Yeah. And attack him with that one, too? I... Because it's its own action. Give me the card. There's a card there somewhere floating around. I saw it. Hammer sphere. This thing? No. I don't know. That was in the book. This book. I don't know what that is. Function as a spectral weapon? Spectral, yeah. Uh, 3d6 bludgeoning once per day. Uses for 10 rounds. Uses my melee attack mods. Okay. Yeah. So Go ahead. Cool. You can command it. As a bonus action, kind of like spiritual weapon. Okay. So I can use it to attack. Yes, you can. Uh, Fourteen plus seven is twenty-one. Good. And that's three D six. Six. Seven. Seven. It uses your mods, oh. so that's your strength. Strength mod. Strength mod is going to be two. So nine. nine. Good. Every little bit helps for sure. So the the hammer sphere, you gotta drop it down. You speak the command word, and a it it, it kind of like begins to take shape like from the sphere itself it's almost like gears and stuff but there's there's more because it, it obviously expands out to be a larger item than the actual sphere itself and it becomes this big uh, sort of steampunk looking type of hammer mm. and it floats over and it s smashes the thing in the leg <laughs> it doesn't seem to do very much at all to it but huh. Yep. Zera. I think I can actually move forward and attack the big thing. Unless I should run attack and slash the... How far away am I? Is your doge out? Whose doge is that? The, is that Lee's That's my doge? doge and that's my doge. No. No, oh, that's, no that's, uh, Never mind. I keep forgetting you're playing different. And I just said that both of those are mine. Yeah, one the of them. Pewter, the pewter one is, is Bark. Yeah. Okay. Bark is going to probably run away. Yeah, there's a reason I haven't really used him. I He's can't squishing. make it to the big guy, yeah. so I'm going to move up to this guy and slash him. And then keep moving this way. Well, unless he's not dead. So, attack. And That's a one. <laughs> That's a one. God damn it. All right. Serendipity roll, please. That is a, a one. Do you seriously roll a one on a one? That's a one on a one. So God damn it, game. What's a hundred? It's all zeros. Okay. Ten. And I'm 
rolled a zero on here, and this is a ten. It's a ten. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. That's that's maximum one inch. That's a one on a one. I'm so excited. Oh. It wasn't me this time, guys. Did you use a club? God damn it, Dave. <laughs> this is you're playing a Zera? Yep, that was Zera. Thanks, Matt. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't break I can't break the heart. Alright. Alright. Um All right. Gives me Like, how bad can it be though? It can be bad. <laughs> the what cave's is, not gonna fall out on me. What does he mind. use? What does he use? A club. club and a shield? He, he doesn't have it described. I don't know what he uses. They are the ones who told me it's a club. Okay. <laughs> it's a magical club that does necrotic damage. I guess I could hit myself. Necrotic damage? Alright. So you go to swing at this guy, right? And he has a fairly high strength, right? Yeah. Like all the way up. Stupid, like he 20. has all the strength. Yeah, 20. he has all the strength. So, you throw this club, not on purpose, but you, you kind of throw the club. And the club is going to fly over here. And it's going to hit the wall. And, and a rock's going to fall. It, 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 it hits with. Uh, such force, such ferocity, because his strength is like stupidly high, that a crack etches its way up to a stalagmite. A stalagmite that's that's falling. <laughs> this is going to be <coughs> kind of reverse one on one for you guys because it's only going to affect Rand. Ah! <laughs> still me. <laughs> God damn it, Dave. <laughs> Now, I well see the other thing. The first time it happened, you brought the building. Oh, I'm down on everyone else. Yeah, okay. But this time, just because of the way everything's set up, and I'm on the wall. You're so, on the yeah. wall. I mean, it makes sense. I'm not saying it doesn't. I'm just bemoaning my bad luck. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna hit. Um. All right, hang on. This is a sizable chunk of stone, so yeah, I need to get. More. Lots of time. I need to get more more of the damages. Look, I can't even dodge. Uh, I do believe that. No, I guess it, it, it would be another set for you. So you can, uh, I don't know about say, have I. Is this a new turn? Ouch. That's a lot of eights. Um, okay. What is, what is this one? I can't really freaking read it. Okay. Thirty points of damage. Oh my! He's dead. And no. no, he's not. I have two, two hit points, and you are knocked off off of the wall, and you're a little bit uh, pinned. By this. Underneath. So, okay. Yeah. So now you all have seen me just struggle it. Well, wiggling. You're, you're, I'm not really your feet. You can still attack and stuff. Like, you, right, you but still shoot, I can't. But you're prone, yeah. so you have disadvantage on attack rolls. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> well played, Sarah. Actually, that probably will work out in your favor because Brand is rage mode right now. Mm -hmm. Um actually it's gonna make it a lot easier. Kyron. Than... You don't know yet. Yeah. <laughs> Kyron, it's your turn. Mm, okay. Trust me, it's annoying for me too. <laughs> so we still don't know what the hell this giant thing is actually actually is, do we? Hey! Sorry. I forgot there's a leg there first. Yeah, little table. Oh. It's so we cool. still don't technically know what this thing is, do we? No. I shot it. You shot it. It's all that. <laughs> Oh, uh, it's never. Yeah. <laughs> I attack Dave with an arrow. Not ran, Dave specifically. <laughs> Just flies up. <laughs> yep, right in the eyeball. Now, um, I don't want to 
wasting any spells right now. So I'll just shoot it with an arrow. Okay. Big target. That's true. It does have armor nestness though. True. So be wary. Be wary of thy shot. Goddamn one. A one! Okay. 37. Okay. One to one. So. It's just a bad dude. miss. Yeah. Because there's nothing, because like you're shooting up. Yeah. And there's no one else that you could really justifiably. We can't let's smash. He's trying to steal it close back. <laughs> anyway. Okay. Um, so that's just a really bad miss. Yeah. It's a bad miss. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I guess I can get rid of this arrow here. So now he goes. Oh, now wait. he goes. Technically they go. Oh yeah, there's still two others. They're going to miss. And uh, 22 you said? But it's going to hit old uh, zero, unless you want to use shield. What does that do? Races your AC. Oh, it's it's used as a reaction. It's not really necessary yet. Okay. Yeah, you're right. There's only four damage. Um, this guy, however, is not. He's actually going to move past you. Like, walk right. Right over you. Right over you. Attack of opportunity. His grundle yep. just dragged against you. You will. The big grundle. There's grundle stalk, yeah. There's grundle stalk. <laughs> <laughs> I'm guessing y'all don't get to use marksman here, correct? No. You just shoot up straight up into his crotch. <laughs> right into his cooter. 20. Where's he at? Uh, fuck, I forgot how this works on this. I still get fire damage or regular damage, right? Um, yes. And I get much more because it's any time I attack. But I don't get blocked. Mm -hmm. No. All right. Well, he is 17. Colossus, but why Colossus. didn't he get Colossus there? Because Gerald doesn't want me to do it. Wait, that was yeah, Gerald. Well, I don't get your damage as well. I, I know, it's you do 17. get Colossus Slayer. I do? Yeah, I it's damaged. I thought I didn't on the tank part too. Oh! Why wouldn't you? Because Gerald, you only get when I did this, turn? I didn't get the... Oh, I gotcha. Yeah, yeah let's, let's, let, let's maintain that rule. Okay, then it's 27. <laughs> Fair enough. 27. Mm -hmm. Got it. Nicely done. Very nicely done. Zara. Uh, yeah. Scrap. There's no like strength check to. Well, it's attack roll. Oh. And it's auto grapple. It hits. It's a big ass. Yeah, it's a big hand. It's a big, big old, big old creature. And Zara is going to take. Crushing damage. Is the big beast still here? Or is it back there? Oh, well, technically it's back there, but it's easy enough to be over there. It's fine. Uh, it will be mm, 25 bludgeoning damage, I guess. Yes. Yeah. You're kind of squeezed by this guy. And then the. Uh, Wait. If he has him grappled, he can still attack with his arms, right? Yeah, I can mm -hmm. attack him. Does that mean that he's in melee range? Oh. Technically, yes. Good to know. For sneak attack? Yep. Yeah, well, it's sneak attack now. Oh. Yeah. Most of it's sneak attack now. Yep, yep. You just get to roll one dice now. Yep, 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 yep. He's um, thing. Well, actually, he would be. He's going to also... He's the biggest thing near you. True. I'm still Rush that dude. working out how my rage works. Oh, yeah. Cool. Also, to focus, <laughs> I should say, focus Dave's rage. He wants to eat bark. <laughs> That'll probably do it. That would do yeah. it. There's one thing to put him into a rage without being magic, magically yeah. enraged. He's it's going a, to move his radiant beam thing kind of down that hallway. God damn it. And I need everybody in there to make a dexterousness roll. Where? Saving throw? What's up? Not you. 
Neat. The dexterity yeah. saving throw, right? Autonomy. Yeah. Natural 20 with twenty three with mm-hmm. plus 3 for Bark. Natural? <laughs> natural. <laughs> natural 20. I want to make sure this is... Then there's natural light. Natural, natural <laughs> ice. Roll 16 plus 4. Okay. Yes, 20. Uh, no, plus 5. Um, anyway. Dex 20? My dex is 19. 14. So plus 4. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, 14. it is plus 4. Damaged. Anyway. Uh, for Halvor. 6 plus... That's your summon, douche? Yeah, I don't have a stats for him written on here. Okay. It's the Do you have bark stats still? Uh, the only thing I have yeah. him with a plus is plus three to dex. Oh, well, plus three initiative. You don't have his health or anything? Uh, well, I have that uh, collar I got, a magic collar that lets him have half of my max HP. Right. Got you it. Know, so he's different. And yeah. I have studded dog armor for him. And so. okay, I'm <laughs> a wolf, not a dog, but true. So wolf stats. If you want to grab the monster manual. I have the mushroom here, hang on. Let me grab it. I got it, I got it. That one's jacked anyway, so I don't even worry about that one. Wolf, you say. Dire wolf, right? I think so. I mean, it's a big fucking giant wolf. Cool. Just wanted to make thing. sure. Is that even back here? Because it's not Guinevar, it's at the back. <laughs> it's not Guinevar. It's not Guinevar. It's fucking awesome. awesome. Yes. Giant. I know it's here. Mastiff. Um. Mm-hmm. Hang on. There we go. What does that mean? Ooh. Ooh. Do it. I don't think it matters. Uh. We just said that it was gonna be a wolf. Oh, it's not a dire wolf? I don't know. Oh. I didn't. Whatever. It's not back here. Is there has got a bird. Uh, wolf. Okay. Technically, we'll say that it has 75 hit points. Okay. I'll write that down now. For analysis type purposes. Um, AC 13. Boo! Cool. All right. Yeah, you're almost dead. Uh, that's going to be 25 damage for those within the blast who failed their dexterity saving throw. I rolled a 14. Good? Huh? I rolled a 14. 14 is not going to be enough. Well, then I'm changing damage. Huh? Okay. So <laughs> good that'll decision. be uh, 12. Bark will succeed. With a natural 20, you said. Yeah, and then he has plus 3, so, so it'd be a 23. We'll say it. with a natural 20 that he avoids all of it. Okay. And then... I avoid <laughs> half with my 22. Okay. Not and then natural. The, the wolf. Wolf rolled a 6 plus... Whatever that number you didn't tell me is. Oh. <laughs> Always with the sass. It was probably a failure. Yeah, I'm sure it, it's a it, fail. It is. So he is going to take... A third of its hit points, essentially like 25 points. Yep. Uh, Dex is 13 for the wolf. Or plus one for strength. It's pretty dope. Strength is 18. Nice. Yeah. It's a, it's a beast. A beasty beast. Um, oh, is that his turn now? Right. That's his turn, Leas. Alright. Well, first bonus action punching the big guy again with wow. my. Big B's hand. Mm-hmm. Big B's hand! Alright. 16 plus 9. Yep. Uh, so three smack in the face with the ethereal hand. <laughs> uh, 48. 48. Good. Eight plus four is twelve. Plus five is uh, eighteen. Or seventeen plus seven is twenty-four. 
24. Okay. And you're kind of punching it like in the back of the head. Yeah, I mean, I'm up there in the face region right, right, right. doing the punching thing. Alright. Um, and then, here in the next scene, I'll do my regular attack. Sweet. Later. Later. 